we've been talking about being efficient and being efficient is is saving money and if you buy inferior equipment that you have to replace a great deal or won't stand up to your livestock that's not being efficient now sure you can go buy a plastic bottom feed bunk cow step in it tomorrow ruin it you can go buy another one or you might get lucky and might last a while but I promise you you'll be replacing it some of you that own them already know that what we would suggest is buying a bunk feeder that will last a lifetime we offer two different types the type on my left is what we call a pipe bunk it's made out of new pipe uh, that's split in half we put legs on it it's an ideal bunk for cake grain feed of that nature and it weighs about a thousand pounds so it's heavy enough that the cattle aren't going to push it around the pasture in other words it'll be where you left it but it's light enough you can still move it this bunk that i'm sitting on here we call the super bunk it performs basically the same task as the pipe bunk but it's for you guys that feed processed hay and silage that need a greater volume either way you go this is new steel it will last you more than a lifetime that's why we call them the forever feed bunks never replace a bunk again be more efficient save money let me show you the most efficient way to put up corral fencing this is called fortress fence it's a panel that comes pre-assembled from the factory it's a 20-foot section it's fast it's easy and it's economical and it is new steel boys let's show them how we do it Now if you'll notice on this end, we have the connectors already inserted. As you see, we leave a little gap right here and we won't weld this. We will leave that for as a natural expansion joint so that heat and cold expands and contracts the steel because it does, it won't bow your fence. Now that we've got this panel joined to the previous panel, we're gonna attach it to the remaining two posts. Now in most cases, you would probably just weld the panel directly to the post, but in case you didn't want it to be a completely permanent installation, we're gonna use this clip to install. We just installed 20 foot of fence in less than three minutes, and now you have a good looking solid steel fence that'll last you a lifetime.